Hey, I'm Jay from the Cub Scouts. Welcome back to another episode of Yandere Simulator. There are a few things that I want to check out in today's episode, especially this new memorial service feature. And also, I want to do a challenge that I'm going to mention later in this episode. But before we do anything, guys, I have some very serious news for you. And I don't want you guys to get emotional because I know how much they meant to you. But Study Kun A and Study Kun B are no longer in the game. They have done so much for this game that I can't imagine Yandere Simulator without them. But wherever Study Kun A and Study Kun B decide to go, just know know that our heart will go on. But like I said, guys, we are going to check out that memorial service in today's episode, as well as a challenge that I'm going to do in today's episode. So if you guys are cool with that and you're down with that, everybody get ready and buckle up, because here we go. Okay, so we're going to check out this memorial service, but before we do that, there's some new posters here that actually look pretty badass. Like, we have the gardening club, the swim club, the science club. That one actually looks dope. Light music club, this one actually looks sick, too. Art club, occult club, drama club, and cooking club. So those are all pretty fresh. What's this one? This one is join the gaming club. That's pretty sad. Like we're all gamers out here. Everybody watching this video, I'm pretty sure we're all gamers. We need to have a better poster than this baby dick one right here, okay? But let's check out that memorial service. So let me grab my knife, foo. And you guys already know what we're gonna do with the knife, foo. I am gonna end this lonely girl's life foo right over here. <laughs> and since I'm lazy as hell, I am just gonna forgive my sins. And then we're gonna see what happens. The police arrive at school. The police discover the corpse of Haruda Poresu. The police discover a knife that is stained with the blood. We know, we know, we were there. The police find Ayane's fingerprints. What? I thought I forgave all sins. Fuck. All right, this time we are gonna dump the knife, Fu. Okay. Turn on the incinerator, end the day, and I'm pretty sure we're not gonna get caught this time. The police arrive at school. The police discover the corpse of Midori. The police are unable to locate any murder weapons. Yeah, buddy. All right, let's get it, guys. Let's see this memorial service for Madori Gorino. No words can express the sense of loss we feel as a result of this terrible tragedy. Oh, that was it? All right, you know what? Since every student is here and I'm feeling a little bit naughty right now, we are going to falcon mode that ass. <laughs> Holy crap, that made my game lag. How about this? <laughs> Oh, that's badass. One more time. Conga line. And teacher conga line. Boom! In the double dams. <laughs> all right. So we knocked out all these people. I'm going to end the day. And let's see if they throw a memorial service for all these people. Holy oh, my shit. God. <laughs> express the sense of loss we feel Damn, as a result of this terrible They couldn't even fit enough portraits tragedy. inside here. Those must have been like the top people that I knocked out with a falcon punch. Okay, but now we've seen what the memorial service looks like. Let's try kidnapping someone and see if they're going to throw a memorial service for them or if it only triggers if somebody is 100% confirmed dead. <laughs> But anyway, guys, that is going to do it for the new memorial service feature. The challenge that I want to do in this game is a challenge that I did over two years ago. Goddamn. But since there are so many new students in the school, I thought I would try it one time. And the challenge that I actually want to do today is the alphabet killer challenge where I got to end everybody's life according to their name. So everybody who's like an A, B, C, D, E, they can all get it in order of their name. But I'm only going to try this challenge once, guys, because there's so many freaking people in the school. Like, say I killed like 30-something people, and then I get caught at like the 35th person i am not gonna kill all 35 of those people again just to start it over i mean i could use the new save feature in the game and then like kill 20 people and then save and then go from there but i feel like that's gonna cheapen the experience so i'm only gonna try it one time and get everybody in one go i do want to do a couple things to make this all interesting since i do have to end so many life lose. the first one is that i'm not gonna touch the student council or the teachers another thing is is that i can forgive my sins in the light music club at any time because if you start to get a lot of people your sanity is gonna go down your clothes are gonna get super bloody so i think in order to save me some time of like constantly changing my uniform i'm just gonna keep forgiving my sins and then we're gonna continue from there but no more talking guys i'm gonna get this challenge started i'm not gonna do too much editing so you guys can see the whole thing from the first kill to the last kill so without further ado let's get this challenge started and hopefully i can complete so the first person we gotta get is beruma dinkuri and i put that she's in the photo club in parentheses so follow me Inside here? Is this a good spot? Computer lab? No, that's where Pippi and Ryoto go. How about here? Nobody ever goes in here. This is a boring ass room, so nobody ever goes in here. Okay. So let's close this. And your life, foo. Wait, somebody heard that. What do you mean, hmm? 
Okay, somebody said hmm. I think it's the student council no, girl. Oh god, my please, god, no, I already failed no. the challenge. You know what, guys? I'm actually gonna end Beruma's life out here because there's so many people patrolling all parts of the school. And I don't think anybody ever comes back here, so get your ass over here. Okay, next up we got Beshi Takamine. She is the girl with the green and blue hair inside the light music club. So she is not right there. So she's gotta be on the other side right here. Beshi, are you right there? No, that's not Beshi. So Beshi's gotta be right here. There you are, Beshi. That's my favorite Beshi, okay. Since this is open, that means somebody goes inside here. So I gotta put you in a place that's more discreet. So the other thing that I forgot to mention with the alphabet killer challenge is that I can't get caught. That's another reason why I'm leaving the student council people alive because they always patrol the halls. And if I get caught, then it's game over. Like if nobody was a threat to catch me, then this alphabet killer thing would be super easy. But wait, this girl's going this way. Does she go here? Well, I don't think she's going to catch the girl right here, but I don't want to risk it, guys. So I'm actually going to put her right behind this bush. This seems like a good bush. The next person we are going to go for is Borupen Saishiki in the art club. And most of these art fuckers are outside here. You don't look like a Borupen. You're a Efude. Okay, Efude? That's a no for me, dog. Borupen is right over here. No, you're blocked face? What you mean blocked face? There you go. I think this is Borupen, right? Yep. Borupen Saishiki. Okay. So I am going to lead Borupen all the way over here. Yeah! And Bablam. Uh. So we got Borupen and next is Budo, Martial Arts Fuckwad. I actually don't know if I can get Budo away from Welcome here, right? I can't ask him to follow Club. me, right? What brings no, you here? he can't. So we lured Budo all the way back here no. and hiya that ass. So we got all the people that start with the letter B. Next, we are going to move on to C, which is Chojo. And fun fact, guys, Chojo is the only person inside the school with a C in her name. Are you a Chojo? Yes, you are a Chojo. Nobody ever looks this far, so get over here. Whoa, what the heck just happened? Uh. Okay, I actually got caught. I was actually gonna lure her back here with Beruma, and I was gonna say, solve that mystery, bitch. I think if, like, a student council person caught me, or somebody that I wasn't supposed to kill yet caught me, then I think the challenge would have been over. But since Daphne was the person that I was gonna kill next, I think we should just keep going. I think this one might be a little tough, guys, because the next person I gotta kill is Dairoku. I don't know who that is. Trouble? Are you Dairoku? No, you're Hakuto. There you go, Dairoku. This is Dairoku. He's not gonna follow me, that's for sure. Let me try beating his ass, and then once he's on the bench, that's when I strike. Punch you in the throat, kick you in the Japanese nuts, and let's get it. There we go, got you all alone. See, I know what to do, guys, I know what to do. And is anybody gonna hear him when he dies? I don't know. Hold on, I guess we gotta risk it. So, kill him? Oh, they heard that. Not really. They kinda heard it, but I don't think they're gonna come here, right? Hold on, I'm gonna run. Next up on our list is Daku Atsu. And I think that's a guy's name. I think it's your name, right? This better be your name. No, Shin? Your name is freaking Shin? What's this guy's name, Leg? No, this guy's Daku Atsu. Okay, far-eyed freak, you're gonna come with me. Wait, I have to tell a teacher. Oh my god. This freaking snitch. All right, you know what? I said I was only gonna try this one time, but we are gonna try it one more time. All right, this one's gonna be tricky again because these guys noticed something. I didn't even know they come back here. So you really gotta be quick. All right, run around over here. No student council. Oh my God, the cooking guy's right there. Oh, what son of a shit done? stick. Are you serious? Lunatic? Two freaking cooking people? Not oh my God, and I'm getting fight. my ass beat by this guy with a scar on his face. Okay guys, I'm back to where I was. This is gonna be the very last time that I do this, for real. I really just wanna get over like 10 people because then I'll feel proud of myself. So Daku Atsu is right here. Let's get him to follow me. So I'm just gonna start stacking people all the way back here because I don't think anybody's ever gonna come here. So Daku Atsu is up next and we are just gonna slice that ass. The last person that starts with the letter D is Dora and she is the blonde haired music girl. This is her, right? Yeah, Dora Tamamoto. And Dora is the ninth victim on my list. So I said that if I get to 10, I'll be happy. And we gotta drag this body over here because those people that go on like the sidewalk right here, they're definitely gonna see that shit. But the 10th person that we need to get starts with the letter E. So gonna bring you to my wall of death and bam. Next is Enpitsu. And I saw you earlier, so I know for a fact that your name is Enpitsu. And this time we're gonna switch things up a little bit and I'm gonna leave his body right here behind the pool. All right, Fred, you're dead. Okay, this next one is gonna be complicated. The guy that I gotta kill is the red shirt bully, but everybody has their shirt buttoned up. And everybody's wearing like a white shirt underneath. But I think that you're Gaku, right? Yeah, Gaku. All right, dodge this. Punch you in the throat. And small Japanese nuts. Oh, this is going to be tough because that cooking guy is coming over here. 
You know what? Maybe I can do it fast enough. Maybe I can get this guy real quick. Okay, get him. Before they come over here, pick up the body. Oh my god, the guy's coming. Holy crap. Holy crap, I can't believe how clutch I am. Nobody saw that. Guys, I am a god. I am the alphabet killer god. Psych. That could have been so bad for me. Like, I'm on a roll right now, and that guy almost got me. That British cab dude almost got me. This fuckboy right here. What's your name? Your name is Sayo. Oh, man, I won't be seeing you for a while. The next guy that I gotta kill is Gaiju. He is the leader of the art club. I could leave his body here because nobody ever comes in here, but the student council person might come in here. Nah, I can't get lazy. I was gonna leave his body, like, somewhere back here, but that's just me being a lazy ass. I could actually leave his body behind here because I don't think that anybody ever comes back here. So let me kill you. Ugh. And Kudeta didn't hear that? Yeah. Okay. Wait, what? No! Oh my god, how did you see that? How did she see that? Like, realistically, if I stand right here, I could not see a body. Oh my god, I should have just brought him outside. Alright guys, but that's gonna do it for this episode of Yandere Simulator. This is the new memorial service feature that you can see if you end somebody's life and they are no longer part of the school. And also, if you guys want to try the alphabet killer challenge, I will leave the complete list that I created of all the students in the description box below. But if you guys enjoyed this video and want more Yandere Simulator videos in the future, make sure you guys give this video one big fat like. And tell a friend today that Jay from the Cub Scouts is dead too!